Hi, my name is Tom Stelman. I am with TIP Strategies. We are an economic development planning firm based in Austin, Texas. We were hired by the city of Denton to help put together a strategic plan for economic development. And this video is meant to be an intro to that plan. So we took the, um, the city and business leaders through a three-phase three phase process over the last several months. Um, we conducted research. We received a lot of stakeholder feedback. We met with business and community leaders, as well as other organizations in the community to develop this plan. The planning process uh, was driven by five guiding principles. And these were principles that were developed uh, through interactions with the board and through the stakeholder input that we received. Core resiliency was at the top. Uh, any community that's going to be successful has to take care of its existing businesses, uh, those that are paying the taxes and supporting the city services. We also feel like being future focused is extremely important, especially in a community like Denton uh, in, a, in an area like the Dallas-Fort Worth uh, Metroplex that has been growing and, and Denton's been in that path. We also, uh, with input, identified inclusive growth as a key principle for this work, that this plan needs to address uh, economic opportunity for all residents. The community has a, a burgeoning entrepreneurial ecosystem, and it was important that that be captured in this plan. And also taking advantage of the fact that uh, through the University of North Texas and the downtown and others within the community, um, Denton is known as an arts and music community and has an entertainment uh, component to it. And we felt like that was very important as part of this process. There were three primary goals that this plan is structured around. And as we all know, we're currently in the middle of a pandemic and economic crisis. And so the first strategy is all about accelerating recovery, taking care of your existing businesses and organizations and make sure that they survive and, and can thrive on the back end of this. The second strategy is where the more traditional economic development uh, focus is. In other words, how do you grow your community? How do you continue to create opportunities? And it's organized around four different growth areas, creativity, connectivity, sustainability, and competitiveness. And the last is really strengthening communities inclusion, making sure that there is a people focus to this plan. So the focus on workforce, housing, and other infrastructure uh, to support that we feel like is important. There are four strategic growth areas that are outlined in the plan, connectivity, sustainability, creativity, and competitiveness. In each of these areas, we outline detailed recommendations. Uh, connectivity, for example, is taking advantage of the fact that um, you have 35 West and 35 East that come together in Denton, uh, right where your West Park industrial area is, and you have major employers that are taking advantage of that. Sustainability uh, is really designed to take advantage of Denton's reputation uh, as it moves toward 100% renewable. Creativity is to take advantage of the entrepreneurial community that is burgeoning within, um, within Denton. And competitiveness is somewhat of a catch-all, but it's really designed to, to catch opportunities um, as a result of, for example, the Cole Hunter Ranch and the expansion there and what that means for the community. So I've provided an example strategy just to let you know how the plan is organized. Uh, specifically, each section will have strategies, there will be actions, and there will be detailed notes to support that. So as you go through it, I wanted you to understand just how the plan is organized. One of the other recommendations that uh, we feel is important is that in order for Denton to remain competitive within the DFW area, since there are a number of uh, communities that have sales tax and have built up funds, we believe that Denton should do the same. And that should be a partnership between the city and the business community. So if you're interested in additional information, we recommend that you download and review the actual plan itself. There's also a video that you can watch of the last uh, board meeting for the Economic Development Partnership. And if you have any questions, don't hesitate to read out, reach out to the Economic Development team.
Thank you very much.